Hello there guys, my name is Chris Shadogs to one bought built for theme park news and welcome to a theme park news update. Now I didn't think I'd be doing another one today, but something just came out on a forum and I really want to discuss this because it's something that I found uh, and I want to see with you guys actually whether you think this is real or whether you think this is fake. Now I want you to put in the comments section down below if you think this is going to be real or fake, but I'm going to discuss reasons for and against the realness and fakeness of this. So apparently it's been leaked what is coming to Six Flags Magic Mountain in 2021. Now before we get started, make sure you like, comment, subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Please share with your friends, family and on social media and make sure you get your questions in using the hashtag question before or after your question for the 1,000 family subscriber Q&A. Make sure you keep donating to all three charities fighting the coronavirus in the description down below and stay tuned on April 7th, 2020 for my two hour, two plus hour live stream to help raise money. And the goal is $1,000. So the donation page is in the description down below. And if you want to individually donate as well, then the three pages are in the description down below as well. Let's get into this video then. So let's put the leaked image or fake, uh, real or fake leaked image on your screen now. Fan Dabby Dozy. Now you can see on your screen, you can see it. A golden horse tilt coaster with the name Martian Manhunter Coaster, new for 2021. Now, obviously, you can tell there's some similarities to real or fake. So, uh, obviously, with the the two people with their hands in the air upside down at the top, uh, that that spells real to me because usually that's what you do with the Six Flags promotions. But there has been past occasions where. Um, it has been spotted at the top and it's ended up being fake, so we can't exactly judge it for sure. But this video is all about discussing the opportunity of an addition of a tilt coaster. Now, firstly, now I'm going off the basis of if this is real. If this is real, I think that a tilt coaster is a perfect addition to Six Flags Magic Mountain. It's the thrill coaster you've been waiting for. Six Flags Magic Mountain fanboys and fangirls and fan kids and fan grandkids and fan grandmas and fan granddads. Fan everywhere. Fans everywhere of Six Flags Magic Mountain have been wanting something record breaking, something new, something unique. Uh, and this is the part that's pretty much got everything you could wish for. Uh, it's got kids coasters, family coasters, thrill coasters. Now, for those of you who need a bit of background information on the rumoured 2021 project, this is set to be, or uh, what looks to be from the markings around Riddler's Revengers Plaza area, this is set to be on the former site of Tidal Wave, which is the park's Shoot the Shoots ride, and also Green Lantern First Flight, which is an intermittent Zack Spinner roller coaster that opened at the park in 2011. And then for 2020, that's set to be moved to La Ronde in Montreal, Canada and open as The Pair, which is Viper in French. Uh, for those of you who need a little channel of fact of the day. <laughs> I'll probably have to redo that bit again. Challenge of fact of the day. The Pair means Viper in French. <laughs> uh, now... Obviously the big thing is what was going to replace that site when we kind of had an inkling or an idea that that was going to be the site of the future project. Well, it looks to me as as if the first sort of rumours were either a B&M dive or a Mac Power Splash. Either an extended model compared to Aquaman Power Wave that's set to open this year at Six Flags Over Texas in Arlington. Um, or potentially the looping power splash concept that Matt released uh, around about a month ago now. It's been around about a month or just under a month since they released those concepts with the rocking boat ride and the looping power splash. Um, I can't remember what they called it, but I know it's, it's, it's just a power splash with a vertical loop. So that's what they've done. Uh, that was one of the rumours as well as a traditional map power splash with a turntable because we know Magic Mountain likes to do it big, likes to do it bigger than other parks. So a turntable with more capacity would have been, and a longer layout than Aquaman Power Wave over Texas would have been the likely possibility. And also there was rumours of a B&M dive coaster as well. But this fake or real, fake or real image of a tilt coaster could prove to 
shakes and stirs into this rumor mill uh, for Six Five Magic Mountain 2021. Now, you know, as we all know, it's very likely that this virus is going to be toned down um, by hopefully Halloween time. So 2021 will be will be quite affected by the economy worldwide. But, you know, everything will start getting back to normal in 2021. So, uh, 2021 obviously is going to be a big year for some projects. We know that Grunalund's Inverse set to open then. Uh, the Valhalla refurbishment at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Loads of worldwide projects set to open in 2021. Obviously, I'm sure Alton Towers and Thought Park have got something up their sleeve. Uh, but... This is, of course, going to throw some spanners in the works with this rumour of a t and this uh, leaked image, potential leaked image, of a tilt coaster. And I like, now this is one thing, big thing I like, if it is going to be real, I think that Martian Mantle Hunter theme is brilliant. Now, it might not be a tilt coaster, however... I think that whatever they decide to go for, I'd like to see a Martian Manhunter theme because I think it's one of the main DC characters that haven't really been utilised as a big ride in a Six Flags park yet. So it's nice that they're using the Martian Manhunter theme and it's nice how we can sort of implement that into the ride experience. I'd like to see a nice theme queue line with like a sci-fi aspect to it. I'd like to see some technological sound effects, some dramatic music just to boost the atmosphere of the experience and the ride itself so i think it's going to be very interesting to follow the developments from this at first i was thinking beat and dive power splash or looping power splash by matt rides this tilt coaster real or fake has put a real spanner in the works now so i want you to comment down below what you guys think about this do you think it's going to be a tilt coaster do you think that the Tilt Coaster leak has possibly put a spanner in the works to the other rumours surrounding this project? I think either way, I think we can safely say that 2021 will be a coaster year for Six Flags Magic Mountain. I think we can definitely agree that. Um, now going ahead then, whether if this is real or not, how would it compare with other projects in the 2021 campaign obviously we couldn't really explain it for real uh because obviously there's still a lot of things to be announced dollywood have got their massive wild World grove expansion they've delayed the announcement for so we're still waiting on the announcement for that uh we've had loads of other things that's going to be going off seaworld orlando rumored to get a coaster potentially a wing coaster or just some kind of bm uh called penguin or codename penguin should we say um Obviously, SeaWorld San Antonio, uh, rumours of this big new ride with the Pufferfish branding on for that. SeaWorld San Diego, the multi-launch family coaster rumour, or, or plan, shall we say. Um, Bush Gardens Tampa with the, um, the Screaming Swing, replacing Rhino Rally's uh, former plaza area. Uh, Bush Gardens Williamsburg with their, their multi-launch shuttle coaster. Giga shuttle launch coaster maybe uh, so this is an interesting one um, compared to other big projects not just in the states but obviously you've got a lot uh, European wise with Grunelund's Invert all the stuff going on uh, around Europe and the UK so I think this is going to be one of the coasters to watch around the world I think with the with the rumor well with this leak of a tilt coaster um, I think this is going to be an interesting one because I I really do believe that uh, a tilt coaster could be a great addition for the park. Like I said, I think that a tilt coaster is stand out. It's very unique to the Six Flags chain. I think it's it sort of it rests my case on the stance that I think Six Flags are going with in terms of investments. I feel like that like one every couple of years or one every year if they wanted to one standout coaster edition that you wouldn't expect at other parks so um like with this for example you've got this tilt coaster and then maybe a couple of other six flags parts may add a 40 free spin or a raptor uh like a single rail coaster but something on the lines of wonder woman rather than jersey devil uh that was another big rumor as well for this project the rmc raptor and the single rail coaster being this like a clone of jersey devil and the markings all matching up with the the jersey devil clone this is throwing a real spanner in the works for that rumor as well so there's, there's a lot of building blocks to this so i don't know how to really describe it i don't want to confirm whether it's real or fake because 
I want to sort of keep my options open, especially with this. And like I said, even though it can look real and be fake news, I think it could still be a real project if it wanted to be. And I think if it was a real project, still keeping our hopes up that it is, but if it is confirmed to be a real project in the summer when Six Flags announces their new attractions, I feel like this would be a fantastic project. It might not be RMC or, or um, you know, Mac Rides Power Splash or a um, b and Dive, but I think this is going to be a great coaster. And to be fair, with the... Um, with the Kadia Park getting a tilt coaster, like a mine themed tilt coaster for the Kadia Park in Saudi, in Saudi Arabia, I feel like this is following trend. I think with that park set to get a, a tilt coaster, I think Magic Mountains is kind of like a test before they approve the plans for the tilt coaster as part of the plans for the new Six Flags Park in Saudi Arabia. Uh, loads of people are saying that's going to go the same way as the China one, but um, I, I, oh, so, so Dubai one, sorry. Um, but, you know, I think that this could be the start of them testing a tilt coaster and maybe adding a couple more tilt coaster on the Six Flags chain. So, this is very interesting news. I'll be keeping my tabs on it. Please like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never YouTube video. Please comment down below your thoughts and opinions. And for now, guys, my name is Coach Shell Kit on the Coast Life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day.